We're back for Barstool Sports Advisors, but we need you to like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like it right here. Subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like. Hey, YouTubers. Like, subscribe. Like and subscribe. Buy the Barstool shirt. Barstool like and store. Subscribe. Like, subscribe. If like we and can, subscribe. And what are we at, subscribers? 100 something. Come on, let's get a quarter million. If we get to half a million by the end of the season, Tommy's going to fuck someone on camera. Ooh. 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 Like and subscribe. Do you agree? Ooh. Yeah. Do you agree? Like and subscribe. Oh. Do you agree? Oh, no. Like subscribe. Oh, come on. One million. Tommy. One million. Do you agree? What, what else do I get? You get one million. We, I we, get a million dollars? No, you so get a million. You get a million show. subscribers. Like and subscribe. Tommy will fuck someone for a million subscribers. Barstool Sports Advisors, America's premier sports information program with Dave El Prez Portnoy, Dan Big Cat Cats, and the source, Stu Finer. Barstool Sports Advisors, Season 5, Week 1. We are back, back, back. Here, as always, with Hannah, Tommy, Dave, and our source, Stu Finer. Fellas, there's nothing better than being back in this studio. Oh, feeling fabulous, feeling amazing, feeling great. I'll tell you right now, with preseason football being such shit the last couple of years and this year, it's as if... There was no preseason. Mm. You can't even watch it. It's unwatchable. It's unbettable. You don't even know who's playing, so I'm grateful to be back. Mm. Dave, how are you feeling? It's always, you know, like a kid on Christmas getting ready for football season, and I had a bad year last year, the man in the suit, so now I'm going to reverse and just go with my brain over the suit and see what happens. Oh, so no Ooh. more suit. No more suit. No Big more brain. suit. No more suit. I'm going to go with who I like. I'm not going to fade myself because I faded myself last year. Came in last 46.4%. No good. Yes, yeah, Stu uh, won with... But I'm going to say this, Dan. Yeah? I've already heard things that make me very nervous. Like? I've heard you walking around the office being like, underdogs, underdogs, Yeah, I love underdogs. all the underdogs yeah, yeah, this yeah, week. Yeah. It's that, bad. It's yeah. bad. No, so, I know. Listen. So do I. Been doing this for a very long time. I'm going to lay numbers then. We, I've been doing this for a very long time. You know the second that you go through the card... And you look at what you've, you know, I do my gut picks. It was all underdogs. That's a problem. Ooh. That's a disaster. Mm -hmm. That's mm. a catastrophe. I'm sure. going to have the best gambling season of my life, though. I'm off to a good start in college. Uh, and we're talking, none of my suits fit. So I got to fix that. That is an urgent thing right now. I put on some weight and I'm uncomfortable. Red alert, red alert, red alert. Dave needs to lose some weight. I don't know how to. Do you want to go on the stupid no, no, transformation? No, no, no. I, 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 I lost 30 pounds. Mincy's lost 30 pounds. By the way, oh, yeah, Mincy, no sugar. No, yeah. su no sugar. That was embarrassing. Uh, he embarrassed me, embarrassed, you embarrassed you also, the company. I, I'm sure you heard. This yes. is, Stu said he's doing a clean season. Oh, clean. Yeah. clean. No drugs. No, no. No, yeah, no. no, no drugs. No saying one, saying one dead. Oh. No, uh, no basically threatened. Gutter, slurs, ass anything, eating. Right? You're not going to hold me to that, are you? Well, no, you said it. I did say it. Mm. But I say a lot of things. You yeah. do say a lot I of do things. Say a lot of things. I do say a lot of things. I do say a lot of things. I do say a lot of things. A lot of things. Okay, so week one, we have an incredible slate. Before we get to the games, our friends at Duke Cannon are sponsoring Barstool Sports Advisors this season. Work harder, smell better, hardworking products for hardworking dudes. Crank the cold with cooling, dry ice, antiperspirant, and deodorant. It's like having air conditioning units in your armpits. Duke Cannon Thick Body Wash is thick and smells great. High viscosity, that's an SAT word, and three times thicker than generic body washes made in the U.S. Duke Cannon supports U.S. veterans. Shop now at Target or on DukeCannon.com. Thank you to Duke Cannon. Look at this. The Thick Hair Cedarwood 2-in-1 Shampoo. I was about to say champagne. Don't drink this. Duke Cannon, do not. Don't drink it. Do they have like a body spray? I'm sure we can get one for you. I would love one. Yes. Yes. They one. have a pomade. This looks like on the pomade is uh, who's the coach who got choked out? PJ Carlissimo. PJ Carlissimo. He is the Duke Cannon sponsor. PJ Carlissimo. Where if he was wearing Shout this pomade, well. he wouldn't. Shout you know what? The trail. He wouldn't have been. He wouldn't have been choked. He wouldn't have been choked if he was wearing the pomade because he would have smelled great with Duke Cannon. Okay, boys, girls. It's time. Let's get to it. Let's do some picks. We have a great slate. And Dave, we're going to start with your New England Patriots at the Dolphins. Dolphins are plus three and a half. Over under is 46 and a half. 
I am a member of TuneOn. I'm just going to say it right now. So they are watching. Expect us. Dave. I thought this line was a joke when I saw it. Year two of Mac Jones. Mac Jones is the best young quarterback in the game. I've had him at the top of the power rankings from the jump. And now people are coming around. Top Pe- preseason. What? Preseason. I'm we're talking about practice. I'm we're talking saying. about practice no, pre- preseason. Go count. look that at that one pick. Go, go, go look. I'm going to be honest, Dan. I don't watch the preseason. I I'm don't. too busy. I don't have time for it. I didn't watch one play of the preseason. I've had lunch. I've had dinner with Mac Jones. I consider him now a close personal friend, mm. and we're talking about going to the Super Bowl. Now, the Dolphins had all this shit in the offseason. They're cheating. They're throwing games. Brady was trying to get part of that franchise. Um, I know the Dolphins very well, and we traditionally struggle there. Patriots getting points. Are we still forgetting Bill Belichick's the greatest coach of all time in the history of the game and he will win more Super Bowls post Brady era than Brady will Mac Jones will lead Whoa. this team to the, yeah I said it so he's it's already two he'll already have at least two, two more he'll have at two. least two more people are so ready to write this team off I'm not I love Mac Jones we go into Miami a place Brady really couldn't win and we get the W 1-0 oh. wow easy pick I gotta, by the way I gotta, easy pick I we started you. easy I got a stat for you. Bill Belichick against a rookie head coach is 49-1-1 one one against the spread. I mean, you're just taking, what, are you just taking stats from me? I mean, it was a made-up stat. He is, so the stat is actually he's 25-4 and four against rookie head coaches. Okay, there we go. Ooh. Thank you, thank you. I was just making sure you're on your game, Tommy. Don't I get am. offended. And it's not bitch. like that's a Brady Can someone stat. just remind me who the Dolphins coach is? Mike McDaniels. He is a uh, cool guy. Oh, Here's the little guy from say. San Francisco. Here's what I'm going to say about a little Mike too McDaniel. Cool. Yeah, a little, too, a little cool. too cool, and this is going to be very mean because I do like Mike McDaniel. I think he's – I hope he's going to be a good head coach. I'm getting some Mark Trestman vibes from him Ooh. because he just – Yeah, he's know, a cool guy. He likes to make people laugh just, at the press conferences. Is it going to – when he has to motivate some, like, 300-pound linemen to go fucking make a tackle at the end of the game, is he going to be able to do that? I don't know. By the way, I and I think Tua stinks. They're watching, so just so you know, I that was Dave, not me. I think Tua stinks. Be careful. I love this pick. This is this is the one of the easier. My mortal locks, probably the easiest pick of the year. But this, when I saw the Patriots were underdog to the Dolphins with Mac Jones and Bill Belichick, I I, I laughed. I laughed. Them. I laughed. I laughed. Listen. Okay. Well, you ain't gonna be I, laughing after you Sunday. Let, let, me, let me just okay. say that. Let me yeah. say that right. Okay. Now. You're not gonna be laughing after Sunday. Okay. Thank God you have a delete button, because delete every fucking thing this guy just said. I don't know how he's worth a half a billion. I don't know how he's a fucking the biggest entertainment sports gambling man in the world, because that was dog shit. I don't know what the fuck you. You're limited in three years you know, ago. Ma- Ma- Patriots Jones, suck. The They're not gonna win the Ma- Super Jones Bowl. Wo- wo- They're wo- not wo- going wo- to the playoffs. And Belichick retires in shame this year. Although I have them winning 10 games. I have them going 10 <laughs> and 7. So it isn't like humiliating, but for the Patriots, it's not there. And I think this game is the Dolphins Super Bowl right now. Because I have the Dolphins winning 11 games. I have the Dolphins making the playoffs. And I have the Dolphins making the playoffs because of this game. As they piss on the Patriots. As Bill Belichick, you're going to die in this game. Out of the box. You're dead, Bill. You're fat. You're a pig. You're going down. Be real. You're moving to Miami. And you're going down here. I love the Dolphins. No, 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 no. Love the Dolphins. This is my death game of the year. Game one. Week one. Fuck what I said. Don't ever listen to me. Listen to me here. Can I ask you something? Yes. Game of the year. I don't think you're smart enough. What? To what you did when you came on the Dave Portnoy show, and with a straight face and almost a, a yes. like Tony Robbins motivational, correct? Thing. Like I'm not doing weed. I'm not gonna say death. Which I'm not. But and then you come and you you do that. Was that a long you just, con? Yes. <laughs> no. Of course it was. No. no when the lights I came on, pre, it was premeditated. Stu, had you eaten yet at palm of my hand? You were like really stupid. Uh-huh. <laughs> I never saw you fall apart. You didn't know what to do. I had you yinging, yanging, zinging, zagging. Death, death, I love death. I'm in the gutter. The two greatest gutter man ever. Me and Portnoy. I'm in, ooh, oh, I'm sorry, I was broken. No, I'm going to have to go back. I'm in the gutter like, yo. That fucking okay, I have Fuck a, you, Bill Belichick. No, 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 no. I have no you. cartilage. Still. I have a, I have a question, a point of order. Yes. Uh, death game of the year. Yes. Is it Bill Belichick's going to die or you're going to die? I'm never going to die. But if I'm living forever. 
I actually believe that. <laughs> There's a chance. Um, yeah, no, yeah. I completely believe that. Yes. You just. I, I think it's what? like, you know, small dogs live forever, short dogs, you're a short dog, sure. you're going to live forever. But yes. if, if the Patriots win this game outright, you have to die. Uh, I never die. But you have to die. I've sustained more loses than any human alive. I'm uncancelable, undeathable, well, no matter yeah, what yeah. I do, I'm ready to roll. That time you did the rankings yeah. was pretty On your close. wife's birthday. That was pretty close. On your wife's birthday. True. I think if we said... It was close. I think if we said... And I apologize for that. <laughs> well, no, you didn't. You said, Comey's really changed that much, Dave? Yeah. I get this. <laughs> Stu, if we told Stu... I'm like, back! If we told Stu, you can have... I'm back! You can have a week of just doing whatever you want, I think you'd be canceled in 24 oh, hours. Yeah. 24 hours, man. <laughs> Seven minutes max. <laughs> Listen, I yearn the days where unboxing meant I'm going to a party and I'm fucking four virgins. That's unboxing to me. That's where I fucking come from, bitch. Okay. Bitch. Okay. Unboxing. <laughs> Oh, I didn't hey, under- Oh! No. I didn't Get know. up. This is the first game. Let's ever. go! Wait, Stu, you were- You've been hey. waiting for this! Don't lie! Don't lie! You're clapping in your fucking house! It's you're not, going they're not gonna back! See it. They're, they're not gonna see it. This is one of the things that, that gets cut. If it's on the floor. <laughs> Anna, All your good work <laughs> what's the weather in Miami on Sunday? It's not gonna be great weather in Miami on Sunday. It's gonna be 90 degrees and a ton of rain. Ooh, Patriot yeah. weather. Yeah, Very I, humid, not great. I already like the Patriots plus three and a half. I like all the dogs this week. It's scaring the fuck out of me, but Tua in the rain, and I like Tua, Tua none, but Tua in the rain, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. Tua's Miami's got, loaded, stop. Tua's got a fat ass. Their uh, offense might be the best offense in football. You okay. really punched me in the back of the shoulder, right where I'm vulnerable. I didn't mean to. Is that your hurt shoulder? Yeah. You're just yeah. so fucking well, fat, and I'm shoulders. so thin that you're like, you're, you're, I mean, I'll move over. Surreal strength. You are fat, by the way. <laughs> it's not my no. face. It's not my face. Oh, dude. no. It's your belly. It's in my stomach. You it's your belly. Yeah, your yeah, old yeah, belly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. my belly. Yeah. You're all belly, but you still have a gorgeous ass and a Okay. Uh, which everyone's seen, let's including me. Let's just go to the next game. Federal oh, crime. Hank, if you don't wrap him up, it's going to be out of control this year. Federal crime. That you just got to let crime. Listen, this is like when you, like, you know, you get home and you, you haven't, you know, been home for like 12 hours. Your dog needs to go out. That's what Stu's doing right now. Yeah. He's he just needs to run. He needs, he's got the zoomies. Uh, he's just running back and forth like a puppy. <laughs> That's all that's happening. All right. Good to go. All right. Packers. to set the tone. Packers and Vikings. Vikings plus one and a half. Vikings are the team, one of the teams, a lot of the media is talking about. New head coach, Kevin O'Connell. Uh, over he? under, he is from San Diego State, uh, was quarterback at San Diego State, from LA. Uh, also maybe the Washington football team. I think he was a backup for the Patriots at one time. He's kind of a everywhere, been okay. everywhere. Offensive guy. I hate him. Offensive guy, Kevin O'Connell. Packers at Vikings. Vikings plus one and a half. Over under is 47. Hannah, I'll start with you with the weather. Alrighty, Minnesota on Sunday is going to be beautiful. It's 71 degrees and completely sunny. Nice. Nice. What are you smirking at, Hank? Well, it's in a dome. I thought that was retractable. No. Tailgaters. People who are going to tailgate I in Minnesota they had on a Sunday. Retractable. Didn't they, no, they, don't have the, they do have a new stadium. It's not retractable. Oh, I thought it was retractable. No. I'm it's thinking, I'm thinking of where the no, Gophers no. was playing outside. No? You went, yeah, that, yeah, but the, you went to that stadium that was Philly special. Oh, I don't like that stadium. Yeah. Um, Tommy, give us a stat to start. The under is six and two the last eight mm. times these teams have matched up in Minnesota, and the Packers' offense has been starting the season slow over the past five years. They average just 19 points in their season open. And Aaron Rodgers has no one to throw to. That as well. He has no one to throw to. Uh, Stu, why don't you start with this game? Um, getting serious now. All oh, kidding aside. Okay. okay. Hold on. Reset. Um, serious. I think the Packers are in trouble this year. Okay. They're not going to win the division, which is amazing, first of all, because they use... Uh, Who's going to win it, Stu? Uh, Vikings are going to win the division with uh, 11 or 12 wins. I and similar to how Miami dethrones 
on New England in that division, making the playoffs. So Buffalo, uh, the Vikings, Buffalo's not in that division No, anymore. Buffalo's the best team in the AFC. They're playing the Rams in the Super Bowl, and the Rams will beat Buffalo. But I'm saying Miami so said, is an up-and-coming team. So Miami's Miami the second-best team in the division. Well, right, Second-best so, team on, in the division. Hold on. It goes Buffalo, Stu. then fall behind Miami, and they're ahead in New England. Stu, yes. here, here's the thing. I don't know a lot, for so don't people, embarrass me. Yeah, for, yes. for people at home, we this went, is a football show, right? We went through what? Stu's entire season Correct. win totals. Yes. We added it all up. Correct. There were 25 more wins than losses. Right. So he's just expecting the NFL to just be so great this year. Everybody. That wins. somehow there's, everyone goes 9, 10, 11 wins. Stu's got the league going 282 and 256. Great year for so the league. Awesome. Great year Take for football. Take the over for the league. Yeah. Exactly. Le- yeah. is, <laughs> well, I mean, and then and then that's the disparity that the good teams are going to be great and everyone else is going to suck. Right, but you have a lot. You of know teams. that actually but can't I, right. happen. Of course, it can't happen. Uh, except for the Lions. No, you said that well, when I said, Tom Kennedy's back. Oh, now Kennedy's back. That's true. So and it's six more wins. So what did I say? They're going to win one. one so they might win seven. seven. So now we're at seven. thirty-two more wins than losses. Correct. Well, listen, I don't. Do I ever make sense? Does it ever end no, up? No, so no, what are we no. talking? I just wanted to let Why everyone know. Why embarrass me in I'm front just, of our show? I'm just letting everyone know when you say every team's going to go eleven and, and seven or six. You actually think that, and it might happen. It could happen. It could happen. Love the Vikings in this game. Love them as a home dog. Love them to just piss all over the Packers. I don't think this will be close. I think this will be a wire-to-wire route. Uh, Aaron Rodgers, after the game, will be eating acid and wishing that he didn't play the Vikings. Mm. Love this game. Mm. This is the best bet. This is a human lock. This is a burial. This is a blowout. Love the Vikings. Vikings win the division. Bet on it right now. Win that division. Bye-bye, Aaron. You're seeing trails, Aaron. You're seeing the trails of my hands. I like this. You're eating acid. You're eating blood. Yep. I'd like to eat acid with you. Yeah. I'll come out of retirement to do drugs if you could get me and Aaron in a room to eat acid. Okay. I would love to I eat would acid. I would do that. noted. Thank you. And the FBI will rate it, and it Thank would be you. great. Thank you. David. All right. I start off, and now I'm already confusing myself in the second game because I start off liking the Vikings. I heard you just mumbling to yourself dogs, all morning. Dogs. I love dogs, oh, dogs. Oh, oh. Stu likes the Vikings here as well. To be honest, I, the line, though, doesn't make sense to me. That's where the man in the suit is coming back because, to me, the Vikings should be favored, not underdog in this game. Packers started slow last year. Aaron Rodgers, I don't, has he been out of practice? He's been on it. Every Two single weeks. show mm-hmm. on the universe, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. all of them. Mm-hmm. So I, I, is his head in the game? He started slow last year. I could see him starting slow. So why why are the Vikings getting points here? Yes, I'll yes. take the Packers. Yes, ooh, I'm agreeing with you. It's a man. It, it wait, up. you're taking the Packers. Too? It was the this is the one game where I went through and I was like Vikings, Vikings, Vikings. And I was like, hold on a second. The Packers kind of like. Is still Aaron Rodgers. Their and, defense and is their good. Their defense is very, very good. good. Their defense was their team. And this year. is what we call a little bit of a free roll for me because I'm going to take the Packers at minus one and a half. And if they lose, I will just dance on Aaron Rodgers' grave. Could win. Win win. Win, lose. win win. They could win by one. It's a win win. Tommy, don't say Wait that. Wait a second. Can I? Can if they I, win by one, Tommy. Can I say something? The egg. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I'll give you a thousand dollars cash. Win. Did the Board of Health right. come in and clean that or something? Well, well, I mean, it's been there's been eggs above his head from uh, Big Cat Thorne. I thought you were taking the Vikings. Season two. No, it's the only season one that I, w- I flipped on because it's it's similar to what you're saying. Like, I, I looked at it. I was like, why? Like, this seems too okay, easy. I'm going to take the Vikings. Though. Okay, then you go ahead and take because the Vikings. Because I was man in the suiting it, which I said I'm not going to do. You're not going to do But I had already man in suit. That's why I'm on the Vikings. Okay, all right, that's fine. Uh, why did I do that with Tommy? That was a great deal for me. Because now, if the Packers win by one, I lose my bet. I have to pay Tommy $1,000, and the Packers won. That That was was stupid. That was was week one, Dan not using his brain. Okay. We got one more game, then we're going to take a break. Chiefs at Cardinals. Mm. Cardinals plus six. Mm. Over-under is 53 and a half. Kyler Murray and his Call of Duty contract. I have put a note (laughs) to bet the Cardinals early in the season. So I'll start. I'm going to take the Cardinals plus six because September and October is when you bet Kyler Murray and Cliff Kingsbury. And then in October, late October, they drop the new Gulag map and then you go against them. I'm taking the Cardinals plus six. Dave. Last year, if people recall, I had an early bet on the Cardinals, I believe, to win uh, the NFC. Mm. You were walking around showing it. it. You were like, hey, look at this. It was like like someone showing his new boat off. You're like, look at this. Cardinals, 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 Cardinals. People have kids. I have my bets. I was showing everybody. I was looking at my bets. 
Uh, so I do agree with you early in the season. This is another one. If this was last year, I do man the suit. I take the Chiefs because this makes no sense to me. This line. Uh, I am going to take the Cards. I also am going to take the over here. Ooh, I like that. So what did you do? Cards and over. Cards and over. Correct. I like that. I'm going to try to limit myself to not doing doubles every single game. So I like the over, but I'm not going to take it. That's restraint. That's responsible gambling. That's what we're all about here. That is what we're all about. Uh, Stu. Always responsibly. Always responsibly. Be responsible. Death game of the year. In in life, death, taxes, and gambling. Okay. Um, I love the Cardinals here, too. It is a quake game. Fabulous, Han. Fabulous. Thanks, I have a gun now. I, I love it. Props. I love it. It baby. creeps me out when you do the hand. I don't know why. When it I say just, that to her? Yeah, it just creeps me out. What would you like me to call her? Hannah? Hannah? Yeah, that's her name. <laughs> Does anyone call you Han? My close friends, yeah. Ah! <laughs> ah! Reveal! 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 Um, if you know anything do about Do you have gambling, her phone number? Do I have her phone number? Yeah. I have her mother's and hers. Yes. Oh, and I have her brother's. Have yes. I didn't know my mom did yes. that. My yes. mom gave me her number. Mother, her mother's, her brother's. I got her brother's merch. I got her number. Yes. Okay, well. Yes. A stupid question by me. Shocking. Correct. Stu doesn't overuse it. Like, I don't. He's actually really good with tech. Well, your mom is probably <laughs> like, why the fuck am I supposed to put $25,000 yeah, on the Yeah, she's so Mets confused. Tonight? She's like, why was this such to me? Uh, back to gambling. Uh, as we know, the Chiefs against the spread of dog shit, and they barely cover a game ever. Why is it any different this year? Now, you could say the odds makers are telling you the Chiefs are going to win this game because they're laying six against the Cardinals, who normally play well beginning of the year. I don't look at that. I just look at the Chiefs as the most overrated team in the history of NFL, and I think they lose the entire game. I have the Cardinals winning 12 games this year. Okay, nice. so in other words, the over is eight and a half, so that is my best over of the NFL season right now. Go over, win total for Arizona Cardinals. Over, over, over. They're gonna make noise in the playoffs, and the Chiefs are not making the playoffs. Whoa. They are not making the playoffs. What's their record? Uh, They're 10 and, and six. Three. <laughs> I have them missing the playoffs at 11 and 6. Okay. <laughs> Every team wins 11 games. I don't care. That would match the Patriots as the best record basically ever to miss Except the playoffs. Except for the teams that won't make the playoffs. Hannah. Yes. Uh, okay, Hannah. Weather in Arizona. It is a dome. Oh, that one, it might be retractable. I think it's retractable. I think we had this conversation They last wheel year. in the grass. I don't flip. know. Coin flip. Coin flip. I don't know. Whatever. It's What's the they be... definitely have air there. Yeah. Yeah. There's, it's not retractable. They have air. I don't even yeah. think it's a dome. No, no, it, no it's it, 100% a dome. They have air. Oh, they okay. have air. They have air. <laughs> Anyways, okay. it's going to be very hot in Arizona. It's going to be 103 dry heat, and though. sunny. Ooh. Dry, Ooh. dry heat. All evening. Not dry so heat. bad, dry heat. By the way, we're going to have a, our, our sports bar will be open there before uh, Super Bowl. Wow. Wow. That is going to be, be a great down. Super Bowl. Yeah. That's, That's going to be a great Super Bowl. Okay. Let's take a break. When we come back, we have two more games, including Sunday Night Football, and then we will get to our Mortal Locks. Coming Tuesday, the wait is over 40 bar school employees will duke it out in the course of three rounds and the world will find out who the best in the office truly is you gotta be kidding me Fucking missed it by a mile. Fucking dominated. So, what's for dinner? 
dinner is served. Pardon my cheesesteak. <laughs> Go to pardonmycheesesteak.com to learn more and order now on DoorDash, Uber Eats, Postmates, or Grubhub. Ready to roll! Ready to roll! Ready to roll! I'm so juiced up! I'm so ready to roll! Listen! This is the easiest week one I've ever seen in my life! Responsibly always! But I got three best bets! Three human locks! Three burials! Three blowouts! And listen! Three best bets! $69! Favorite number! Favorite position! I'm going 3-0! and I'm going 3-0! and Open the first week of the season with me your sauce to find out. Three and O, oh, three best bets, 69, ready to roll. StuFighter.com, StuFighter.com, StuFighter.com. Barstool Sports Advisors, we are back for two more games on Sunday, week one. This one's a great one, fellas. Raiders at Chargers. Chargers minus three and a half, over under is 52. The Raiders have Devontae Adams, the Chargers have Khalil Mack, and the Chargers are everyone's darling. The media loves the Chargers. Always Chargers though. this, Chargers Always. that. All the way back to LaDamian Thomas and in Sean Merriman. Uh, I mean, LT was Patriots electric. Patriots would fucking smoke them every year. Uh, Tommy, give us a stat. Usually a good bet to take the points in this matchup. The underdog has covered 19 of their last 26 times, and Derek Ooh, Carr, 6-2 and two against the spread in week one. In I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, also, Josh McDaniels, new head coach of the Las Vegas Raiders. Uh, Hannah, it's a dome, but give it to us anyway. We're a lot of domes on yeah, Sunday. Yeah. 80 degrees and sunny in Los Angeles on Beautiful. Sunday afternoon. Beautiful. Stu, I'll start with you. Have you been there yet? To SoFi? Yes. I have not. Have I've you? been to LA, not to SoFi. I have not so been to that stadium. I have no plans on ever going to that stadium. <laughs> it's the hottest ticket in the world. It I is? Mean, every, it's the hottest ticket. It's like a, it's like a seven hundred dollar get in. No, I disagree. For the Super Bowl, any ticket. No, any, no. any, no. any, any. Go look right, right now. now. Game time. Pull it up on StubHub. There is no way an NFL regular season. Every game, game is especially sold especially out. Especially Chargers game. No, I know. Every no, game is sold out. Not true. They pump in crowd noise. Oh wait a second. Sorry, you think I lost. You're thinking, I'm thinking of Vegas. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Have you been to Vegas? No, I have not. This game's not in Vegas. Have it you been not. to Vegas? I have not. I've been to That's the, city, the hottest but I ticket. Haven't. It's a 700 get in the entire year. Well, that. Some of my people have a season tickets and they sold the whole season. Some of your people? Yeah. I'd love, I love to see some of your people. Yeah. All right, so I'm looking right now. Chargers people. at Raiders when they play in December. That's $250. Chargers at Raiders? Yep. And then wow. uh, get in for Cheap. SoFi is 150 Yeah, that, I mean, it shows you. It's 40% more. Yeah, right. But I just but told you, you 700. 700. Well, who the fuck listens to me? That's what a, are, what are you talking about? I, I mean, is everything gone to shit here? We've been away so long, people think I tell the truth. One thing you can guarantee, I never fucking tell the truth. All right. Uh, love the charges in this game. Love Texan, them. Texans at Raiders, $187. Texans are not even a fucking football team. Okay, well, let's get They're going to win one fucking game. Us. They have to pay you to go to that game. Okay, Cardinals at Raiders, $214. Car that's a good bargain. That's a bargain. <laughs> let's go to that game. I'll treat. I'll go to, can we go to that game? We, are, we will can be we in Vegas private then, plane? but no. Why is Penn shunning you on the private plane, by the way? I heard you complain. That was embarrassing. I, I didn't complain. Oh, you did. No. no, you really did. No. You said, I can't get the plane because the stock's not up. And that's that was, a fact. That's a complaint. You just no, asked a question. Yes, wait, you knew that's, the a complaint. that's a statement of fact. Oh, that was a, that was a Davy wine. Stop. No, statement uh, of fact. We know you. That was a wine. Statement you complained. You, I can't get the plane. I went to the stock. Why? The stock goes up. They gave me the plane at will. They gave me anything I want. The stock goes up. Chris, because the stock goes down, I buy commercial. That's how it works. You're flying commercial. I know. Can you believe it? It's no, gross. No, I don't believe that. It's gross. Imagine it's people disgusting. walking past him and being Imagine hey. sitting next to him and you're oh. like, Tay Portnoy, I, I would sell my those, stock what, immediately. What, what if I'm sitting next to you on commercial, first thing I do is call the EFO. What, what sell pay! Yeah. Do you order your fucking that cover, mind? Like, your entire face? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wear those Remember so uh, Donald, no eye contact. Donald Sterling's yeah, yeah, girlfriend? Vivian, yeah. She just walked just around with a mask. Right, you have to wear a mask. Come on, let's be real. Don't want to be. Come on now. What did that, what did that, big Magic Johnson, what did he ever do? He got AIDS. <laughs> One of the all-time quotes from Donald Sterling. And I was on the, I was in that uh, edition of Sports Illustrated. They torched me in that edition. Oh, the one where the goldfish beat you for the year and so no, the no, dog. This was, this was before that one. Oh. Yeah, they had like some, they had some scientific reporter pay me. 
and over three weeks, I hit like 35% and they torched me. They yeah. thought that was funny. What was the, wasn't there a year where they hired a dog was, no, 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 and a goldfish no, to was, beat you? That was a decade later. Yeah. When I was against a dog and a two-year-old girl. And they beat I you. I hit 57%, the dog hit 58%, and the girl hit 59%. Oh. That's just bad luck. And I Chargers Raiders. Oh, now that I thought the season. game was, now it's in uh, Chargers. Yeah. I'm going to use Raiders. I love the Raiders wait, in this game. Wait. Forget the Chargers. No, I love the Raiders. Hold on. The Chargers. No, no, Raiders. No, no. It's at the Chargers. I know. I want the Raiders. But you, now. but you, if you I, were. If, I you, want the Raiders. But you thought the Raiders were at home plus No, three I didn't and a half. think that. I just want to be at the stadium with you guys. Okay. That's fair. Banging bitches and drinking beers. Mm hmm. Isn't that what we do? We bang bitches That's all we do. Beers. That's no, literally no. all we Thank do. You. We just bang bitches and drink beer. I haven't banged a bitch beer. and drank a beer in 40 years, but I would <laughs> like to. I would like to. Stu actually asked me, he was like, you know, next year when we do advisors, if we do it in Chicago or Miami or wherever, all over the place, he's like, are we going to go out and bang some bitches? And I was like, <laughs> yes. Of course, dude. Right. That's all what we did. What did I say? Well, I don't know what you said. You I said no. Oh, no. That's I right. No. no. The answer a, is no. we're married. Yeah. B, we're upstanding citizens. But most importantly, let's throw down the gauntlet. We don't have prenuptials. Right. Thank you. But we would, we can if we want. It's going to be like the Beatles. Yeah. The Beatles. The women are going to wear skirts with no underwear, pulling them up, saying, what do you think? <laughs> I'll be like, I don't know. You're a pig. <laughs> <laughs> Who else would do that besides pigs? Okay, Dave, what do you got in this game? I'm going to take the Raiders. Okay. <laughs> it's going down. Tommy. Now. We're losing him. I gave a stat. You already. gave a stat. All right. Uh, another take, Quake. Another Quake. <laughs> I'm taking the Raiders. I'm also taking the over. Over 52. Raiders plus three and a half. Shootout in LA. Oh, wow. I think the Chargers are going to be very good. I just think their defense is going to take a minute to gel. Uh, all right. Sunday Night Football. Let's do it. Bucks at Cowboys. Cowboys plus two and a half. Over under 51. David, have you heard the rumors that there might be some trouble in paradise? Yeah, those rumors have been going on for a while, to be yeah. honest. But uh, that is what I'm basing my pick on. I do think there's some smoke here. Mm. And football is not a game you can have one foot in, one foot out. Brady's face looks like gaunt. It looks like he has all the stress in the world. He uh, missed, what, 10 days of training camp? 11 days. I do not think Brady's going to be ready for this game. I think he's going to be distracted. Uh, I love the Cowboys here. I think they win this game, win it pretty easily. Tom Brady is uh, my quarterback on my fantasy team. Mm. He will not get the start this week. I don't think he has Ooh. his head in it. Who will start? I, will start? Uh, uh, I pick uh, Matt Ryan. Oh, off of waivers. Matty Ice. Yeah, Matty Ice. He's, he's playing, he's playing uh, the big Texans. Yep. But, yeah, I've been watching Tommy in practice, and I don't like where his head's at. Okay. Ooh. I – I agree with you on the Cowboys. I just think it's simply everyone's down on the Cowboys. Mm. Like, everyone's down on the Cowboys. Why? I, because they had a bad offseason. Amari Cooper's on, on the Browns now. Randy Gregory, I think, is on the Broncos. There's no left they tackle. They lost their left tackle. Michael Gallup isn't going to start. You know, he's, he still has a few, a few weeks before he's back from his knee injury. Everyone's down on the Cowboys. Mike McCarthy, big, fat dummy. He is a big, fat dummy. He is a big, <laughs> fat dummy. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. There's something about how fat he is, and then he makes a mistake. It's just like extra fat. He does, and, and when he makes a mistake, his face, he kind of looks up at the scoreboard. Yeah, with right. Like a bewildered look. He's like, mm -hmm. someone, someone changed this. Yeah, he is Fix one of the this. least inspiring faces in the history of the NFL. He did get me with the watermelon smash, though. That one, I'll never forget the watermelon smash. Yeah, I, I love the cat. I, I, I think the Bucs are going to struggle very early in this season, which isn't untraditional for Brady. Yeah, that's true. But uh, I, I really think if your wife is bolting around and mad that you're coming back. I, football is an all-in game. It really is. It's an yeah. emotional sport. Yes, mental. All right, I have, the Cowboys. I have the Cowboys as well. Tommy, give us a stat. Uh, yeah, as you were saying, Tom Brady just 2-6 and six against the spread in his last eight season openers. Cowboys have also covered seven straight as a home dog. Wow. Okay, nice stat. Uh, Dallas Thank you. on Sunday? It's going to be 85 degrees and clear in Dallas. Mm. Beautiful. And then, Stu, you won't give us a pick, but no, you'll tell Thomas, us. No, Thomas, just catch this. And can I say your guest looks immaculate, impeccable. Do Cannon. Shout out to Tommy's mom and dad. Oh. Big, big followers on Facebook. We go back and forth the entire week. Do you know Do you that? you follow him on OnlyFans? Um, I don't. 
T uh, uh, that's Tico creepy. make out I know out his there mother now. and father, so I'm embarrassed for them that he's even on yeah. OnlyFans. How much money so, do you make on OnlyFans? Not much. I have, I have like 30 know? subscribers. Yeah, sure, i, I got to be honest. I, I think I've told this story, but I use the public restroom, which I don't like to do. But I was taking yeah. a piss, and it was a closed door. And Tommy didn't realize I was in the bathroom. And I heard him honestly discussing that there must be an error with OnlyFans. He's like, well, there's only five. I think I got to call OnlyFans to see what's wrong. And then I just opened the door and looked at him. And he was mortified. <laughs> I was calling for a video. The, the video is that. So you could subscribe to my OnlyFans or you could just watch the video of, of a documentary of me becoming OnlyFans. Have you shown well, that? You were, but you, there was no camera in the bathroom. You were discussing honestly. I mean, it's absurd. I, I, Jordan glitch. Kelly, they're making $100,000. I mean, you, $200. I he, was talking, he was talking to Rome saying there has to be a glitch. I need somebody to talk to at OnlyFans. There is, and there's no customer service number. So I, call, <laughs> I called Google instead. I, call, I went right to Google. I called Google. Show your cock. Have you shown your cock and balls? No, I haven't. You have nothing to lose. I These made out with girls Tico. Do. That's better than a cock. Show your cock and Show balls. Show your cock. You're hung. We know this, but the world doesn't prove it. No, if the Packers win by one, I'll give you $1,000 if you got to show your cock. Oh, let's do that cock bet. That, yeah, and I usually they don't have to win by exactly it. one. No. It's a one I need more than a thousand dollars. Exactly cock. one. No, well then you get on OnlyFans. Yeah, every inch it's above seven, you get a thousand more. <laughs> no, that's show, greatly right, demoralizing. How about you show the shaft? You put your cock on OnlyFans and nobody signs up. <laughs> you show yeah. the shaft, not the head, not the balls, just the shaft. No shaft. No, I, no one will be able to know balls. what it is. All right, balls, balls. Packers no, win by like one. My my no, come my on. Balls. I have awful balls. Packers win <laughs> by, so by one. I give you a thousand dollars. You show That's your balls. That's not a good bet fans. for me. No, it is. I mean, it's not going to happen. But what? You... But but then you could make money. At, well, or yeah. I was no, about that, to shut come down. Come on, this the is the show. Yeah, that makes this sense. Show. Nobody's buying that. Come on, do it. Make Everyone's going to be watching this game. It's the balls bet. Make it a PFGT. Come on. PFGT. Come you on. Know what that is? Just uh -uh. by one. They have to I win by exactly one. No, you have to know. Dan, do you know what PFGT know. means? No. no. Do, do you know what PFGT Hank, PFGT? No, I can't. Okay, I can't deal. Do this. No, no, no. What no, world no. are we Sorry. living deal. in? Deal. PFGT. Deal. 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 No, I right, you got, got it. it. The Packers win by one. You got it. Tommy gets $5,000 from me, and he has to show his balls on OnlyFans. Do you guys, do the fans out there know what PFGT means? This is going to be just stuck. Disgusting. It's not disgusting. What is it? Perfect fit, great taste. I don't. I'd, I'd almost rather show my penis than my. All right, show your penis. But I, I, let no, me decide. Show your penis. Done. done. All right, I don't want to do either. Say. I'm not agreeing to do. Give me thirty you, seconds, you, guys. No, I said. What about five? You agreed to. I did not you agree. No, you did. You said five thousand no, dollars. Doesn't agree to. No, it. he said five thousand dollars. I said what about five thousand? And I just, said deal. Uh, just deal. Just, that's, that's, that's shumming that's, the waters. That's, that's, uh, you can't. That's negotiation. Deal. That that is not. He hasn't yet agreed to it. Do you agree to five grand? Five grand, they have to win by exactly one, and you have to show either your penis or your balls. You wanna end on that? Oh, I, uh, Make it I'm 10 grand and he has to show both? No, no. This is a losing bet for us. I don't <laughs> wanna see any of it. Yeah. Well, I want him to have to show it. I know. The odds of it hitting a middle are 20 to one though. Right, and then we can bet the, the twenty Packers to one shot. Fine, I'll give you five grand. All right, all right ten thousand. Ten grand. Ten thousand to Tommy. Packers win Going by one. Once. Full dick, though. Full dick. Full dick. Full dick. Full dick. Ten thousand, <laughs> Tom. Full That's dick. the most you're gonna get in your life for showing Full your dick. dick. And you're gonna get. What is everyone? You can put it on and take it twenty four hours. Twenty four hours, and you can get. You'll get money on OnlyFans. Right. People will well, go no, subscribe. that's the risk because if no one signs up, that's greatly humiliating. But what do you do? But it's like making ten thousand. You can do that. Can't you make the pictures like a hundred? dollars to buy it yeah I guess so. so there you go come on you went to college you're shocked perfect man. all right Ten no, he has any all right he, this is you a agree? I don't want all right then it's off it's off he, he don't want to do it Ooh. all right fine all right. It's <laughs> all right back to me let's say this is so, my game on the year well, Sunday night game the, you stop you listening to them what and I can put I'm trying to pitch paywall paywall cock for at least 24 we hours. We can't go to break. I have to talk for 20 seconds. This is my game of the no, year. Get over to Stu Money. Yes, they do. No. We always do. Always during this Sunday game, we always game. do. Where have you do been? The, this no, is my show, but game. you own the show. Stop. He gets so game of the year. I own this game. Sunday night, you're going to be buried, destroyed, murdered. You responsibly lost all your money. I will responsibly get it back. StuFighting.com. Sorry. Total. Parley. Game of the year. Finer.com. I just, I'm just thinking of like the Packers, like the Vikings missing an extra point, and just so having that score, just be like, yeah.
Okay. I mean, hey, listen. When isn't, by that exactly one is fan, isn't that OnlyFans? Yeah. OnlyFans is the paywall. Yeah. Right, right, right. But you could also put pictures behind it. Yes, you can. Yes, you can do that. You're allowed to do that. Okay, great. Great deal. Isn't Uh, that all? Yes. I'm confused. No, you're confused. Well, there's like a subscriber audience. But then you could also put a post behind it. Yeah, Tommy's going to be like, oh my God, I felt so horny this morning. (laughs) Oh, no. uh, (laughs) (laughs) Click on this button to buy my morning morning wood. Are you a grower or a show it, Tom? more right, of a grower, enough. so I have, <laughs> to, I have to get okay. hard. Okay, okay. Yeah, honestly, it would be the worst 5000 I've ever spent because <laughs> I don't want to see it. It's but it's great for content. Yes, it's great for content. All right, we're going to be back in we a second. We need plenty balls to verify as you, too. So he's going to be there. He's got to take shoot. the picture. <laughs> he's got to take the picture. That's true. <laughs> if you could put anybody. He could, boot, he could do a stunt cock and we would never know. <laughs> This is true. It's true. You're gonna have to have oh. two, two. What is it? Uh, two-factor authentication. Well, We're gonna I need trust that. Plenty balls. He's yeah. Stand-up yeah. Stand up guy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's take another break. We'll be back right after this. The mortal locks. Hannah, what are you wearing? Well, Stu, I just got off the golf course. I'm filming my new YouTube channel, Amateur Hour. Yeah, no, 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 whoa, 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 what is this? Uh, this sports advisor season, Hannah! Yeah, this probably isn't the right outfit. No! I had to film all my new videos. Fabulous golfer! Steph Curry golf winner and loved her! I love her! You love her! Anna Tower! Hannah Cook! Let's go, Hannah! Let's go! Like and subscribe, like and subscribe, like and subscribe! You've been asking for four years. You've been saying, Stu, where's the shirt? We need a Barstool Sports Advisor shirt. We want to wear the shirt. You'll be able to sell thousands, hundreds of thousands and millions. Here it is, the best shirt ever on the Barstool store. Me, Dave, Dan, while you're watching our show, while you're making your bets, while you're having the best year of your life, here's the shirt. And listen, get over to BeLikeStu.com for all your shout-outs, all my merchandise, everything I have. Let's go! Ready to roll the best year of your life. BeLikeStu.com. BeLikeStu.com. Shout-outs, merchandise, books from your source. BeLikeStu.com and shirt. On the Barstool Store! It's Mortal Lock time, and it's brought to you by our friends at Skrill. Skrill is the best digital wallet for gamblers because it was built by gamblers for gamblers. Use Skrill to manage bankroll using the wallet, which allows them to pay instantly and securely its payments without limits. Uh, basically, make sure to sign up at Skrill.com slash Barstool to create your free account and complete the account verification by clicking Follow the game after registering so you can start using their digital wallet today. It is meant for gamblers. Sign up for Skrill today. Again, go to skrill.com slash barstool. Mortal Locks, it's time. Should we have a bet about the Mortal Locks? Who wins this year? Hmm. I always win, so let's go. Okay. Maybe we'll we'll think of something. Uh, How about (laughs) 100,000? No. Uh, I don't understand. You're worth 350 million. You're worth, let's say, 25 million. I'm worth less than all of you, and I'm the one who's laying out the money. I missed it. Okay, right. you want to do 100 thousand? No, absolutely not. You know, <laughs> I don't have any fucking. I don't have fucking your money. Stop your shit. Don't call me on that. Don't embarrass me. <laughs> All right, don't Stu. embarrass me, Stu. What? Uh, who? What's what? your What's your mortal lock? Um. <laughs> You look like that comedian right, um, right now. What's It looks like, like, listen, the odds uh, are next like year. Voice? No, yeah, uh, not Bobcat, but who the fuck is the The one the who wears the beret? Guy? The one who wears the beret. Maybe. Gallagher? No. He wears the beret. He's no. Yes. What? Bruce Valanche. Bruce Valanche. You look like yeah. Bruce Valanche. Stephen Che said Bruce Valanche was an A-list celebrity. <laughs> exactly. That tells you what his brain Here is. Here I am. Yeah. He said, when, Shout we're out LA, Stephen che. when we were in L.A. for the Super Bowl, he texted the group chat and was like, that, yeah. you guys won't believe who I saw. And we're like, who? He's like, Bruce Valanche. What? <laughs> Go ahead, Stu. I have no idea who that is. Yeah. Um, Trey Lance is going to throw four picks. Okay? Yeah. He's going to have a shit season. And odds are, next year's show, it's either Miami or Chicago. I think we're going to be in Chicago. So, my mortal lock. Shout out, Eddie! Shout out, Boston, Chicago! The Bears! Plus the seven! Mortal lock! Season five! 
Fight Week One. I love the pick, but what does what any of that have to, to do with, with it? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> has to do with that. What you're wearing, Bruce uh, Lynch. Why are you Bruce Lynch? <laughs> well, my dream in life is to fuck Dave. Yeah. Have him spit down my mouth and put a chain on okay. me. <laughs> and I figured I'm not gonna get it without the wig and the hat. Okay, perfect. Good answer. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Good answer. Thanks. Good answer. Good answer. Thank you. Uh, all right, Dave. <laughs> Dave, you're. I'm borderline. doubling up, but this game I, it is honestly one of the easier NFL games I've ever seen. I'm not just saying that, but Tom Brady is. I, I just said it. His head is not in the game. He is thinking about his home life, whether he's going to retire, whether he made the right decision. Yeah, he'll round into shape, and the Bucks will be fine. We, I don't know. Uh, the apple picking analogy. Once, once the leaves are off the trees. Count on Brady. This game, no chance. Cowboys, how about them Cowboys? 1-0. They're going to win this game. They're going to win this game by double digits. It's honestly one of the easiest games I've ever seen, so I had to double up. I love the Cowboys. Wow. Love Ooh. them. Okay. Uh, all right. Ooh. My mortal lock is a lesson in future you problems because in the NFL draft this year, I was watching the NFL draft, and I said, these fans are incredible. I'm going to give a Big Cat Fan of the Night award, and whoever I give it to... They get my mortal lock for week one. I didn't think week one would ever come. It has come. And unfortunately, I have to take the New York Jets. This is the dumbest pick ever. Woo. They are not going to win this game. They're probably going to get blown out. But I'm a man of my word. Hannah's got the Zach Wilson. Hannah, way too young for Zach Wilson. So young. I would never. Look at fabulous, Han. This is the only thing I have on my side. The only thing I have on my side is I hate this pick so much it might win. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, I ran into the little thing. So I've said this before. Joe Douglas is a close personal friend of mine, GM of the Jets. He actually is who hooked me up with my doctor. And Jerry Thornton wrote just an evisceration of him. Just an absolute Jerry Thornton classic. Like you got it. You got what Jerry be Jerry. thousand words on why Joe Douglas sucks. And I get a text from Joe being like, ah, I didn't think I'd catch shrapnel from one of my good friends. Tough. The Jets are in trouble, though. The Jets are in trouble, but not this week. I have their running back in my uh, fantasy team. Uh, Bryce Bryce Hall. Bryce Hall. I'll tell you what. And I like who's the good-looking wide receiver from Miami who dates Olivia Brown. Braxton Berrios. Braxton Berrios. First trap king of the NFL. He's taking the throne from Julian Edelman. Yeah, he is. And and that's actually my analogy. And you got the quarterback out fucking MILFs. And you got uh, him running around with Olivia Couples, Couples' beautiful sister. They act like the Patriots minus all the wins, and I don't like that. Like they wear he's good, he's good T-shirts. None of them, none of them's good. They're yeah, all the terrible. He's, he's but I am rooting t-shirts. for Joe as much as I hate the Jets. Okay, so New York Jets plus seven. That is my mortal lock. We're gonna be live streaming on Sunday, right? Yeah. Hoboken. Oh boy. Woo! We're gonna watch Tommy have to show a picture of his dick. You can do it on the live stream if you'd like to do that. That's oh, almost better, Tommy. Right. I was giving you the. I was being nice. Uh, I'm surprised you care, Tommy. Since when do you care about anything? Yeah. I you mean, made that, out with Tico, Texas. That's a leap. I don't know. How was she? Not bad. What if you become a porn star? I mean, there's I a lot of things she could do. I'm I, sure make it. I guess Sorry. we found your limits. So, <laughs> Jets, Cowboys, Bears, Mortal Walk Parlay will be in the Barstool Sportsbook. I and think we're hot. We're hot on those. We're we're I did my part. part. These guys have to do theirs. Okay. And we, I think we even get a half a point because, you know, we don't want pushes. So, it might be Jets plus seven and a half. I think Cowboys are plus two and a half, and the Bears will be plus seven and a half. I love the hooks. Love, love it. it. Welcome back. Love love it. Welcome back, football. Great we show, love you. everyone. We're only great because of you. Thank you for the support. Spread the word. Be advised. We'll see you next week. Be advised.